Hey guys, this this is Hilary Umongush Hash, and uh, I'll be playing Minecraft for the first time in a few months. Now this is 1.15.2, and uh, I've heard that there are bees in Minecraft now. Oh look, in this picture, I'm guessing that's how the bees look. And they're pretty big. I remember one time years ago when I made a Minecraft mod where I add bees into the game. <laughs> well, anyways, let's start. Single player, create new world. Let's name it Umongus. <clears throat> I'll be on survival mode. Turn the bonus chest on. Cheats off. Generate structures on will type default for the seed. Uh, let, let's just leave it blank. Done and create a new world. And, and now it's gonna load. that face and also this one. Oh look it's loaded well back to game well right, let's look at the options video settings full screen resolution current biome blend five times five well, let's increase the render distance to 16. The maximum frame rate. That's probably best like this. Smooth lighting. Minimum. Yeah, all this seems good. So done. And back to game. <laughs> there, there should be a bonus chest. I turned it on. And bonus chests are usually surrounded by torches. Yeah, let's destroy some grass to create some leaves. Or to, to get seeds. Well, it looks like seeds are a lot less common now. I saw some chickens earlier and also some sheep. Oh, I can't find the bonus chest anywhere, so I'm just gonna go ahead and mine some tree. And after I mine all this wood, the leaves are just gonna start disintegrating themselves. And then I'll collect some saplings. Yeah. The seeds are gonna be for a future farm of Where should the Minecraft house be? Well this hole doesn't look like a good place to build a Minecraft house. It would be to build it in a flatter place. Well, let's build it here. We can start by making... Turning this into wood planks. Making a crafting table. treasure chests
itu. Ah. Now where was that tree that I destroyed? It would drop more saplings. Well, let's just destroy another tree. Oh. And also this one. It'll be easier going from top to bottom. some sticks. Oh, really time consuming. And I've, I've thought of a name to make these Minecraft gameplays. I'm gonna call them Umongous Vlogs. Or Umongous Mine Vlogs. Because they're vlogs of Minecraft when it's being played by Taylor Umongous has. Now let's just throw all these away except for the apple and pickaxe. I'm not gonna build any gear out of wood because I'm, I'm just gonna go get stone. Uh, a good place to mine. How about here? <laughs> Mining with an apple. Let's see which brightness the settings on. Oh, is that its brightest? Right. Well, to make the hole easier to find, I'm gonna build some stuff around it. This would be a doorway. And then some surrounding blocks. Yeah. And let's get back to mining. Yeah, it gets much easier to find cave, well, to find certain minerals that are higher up than stone if, if you ever find a cave or gravel and it's getting pretty dark and it's even on its highest brightness so it seems like the game may have changed its brightness settings too Ooh, found some coal. And now I can go make torches to light up the place. Which will also keep monsters from spawning. By the way, one really helpful tip when it comes to fighting enemies in this game. Well, shields are really useful have a shield equipped into your second hand oh all right back to the stone I'll come back for this coal after I make a stone pickaxe And this white stone that I'm mining 
it can be it can be used to make the house okay so so it's called diorite yeah it seems like they changed brightness settings for this game Let me see if I can craft anything with diorite. Polished diorite. Oh. Hmm. Alright, so we can craft. Let's see if we can make anything out of gravel, andesite, diorite and cobblestone, mixed. Well, I don't really want to be using any of my cobblestone though. Well, even though cobblestone is actually really easy to find. I'm just going to save up more diorite, then polish it, and then make it into this. Let's make a stone pickaxe. Yeah, let's make a bunch of stone items. Stone pickaxe. A stone axe. A stone sword. And a stone shovel. Oh. Yeah. Also a stone hole. Heh, <laughs> hole. <laughs> Why do they even call it that? Oh. Uh, we don't need the stone necks yet. Now let's just use all these. And uh, there was water somewhere. I'm gonna save it for later when I make some buckets. I wonder what I can do with gravel. I'll just keep the extra gravel as some kind of extra block. Yeah, let's also make some torches. Ooh, it's getting dark. The monsters are gonna start spawning. Wait, furnace. Coal. Okay, now actually let's put everything away except for the sword. Since I'll be in combat the whole time. Wait, what difficulty is it on? Normal. Oh, the monsters aren't spawning yet. So let's actually go mine. Okay, one torch here. One torch here. Let's mine all the coal here. Yeah, there are two patches of coal. <laughs> I guess coal is something you'll never run out of in this game. Hmm. 
Oh yeah, also I've been looking at the Minecraft wiki and it says that uh, for the next version of Minecraft that will come on, which is 1.16, there, there will be a new material called netherite, which can be found in the nether, and it requires diamond to mine, and uh, oh, iron, and it's even more powerful than diamond, well the netherite, not the iron, yeah, let's mine this iron. Oh, this this is kind of a lot. Ten iron. I'll be making a bucket and an iron pickaxe and a, a pair of she shears. I'm gonna use the shears to shave the sheep so that when whenever there's night time and I don't want to fight all those monsters well the the player will just be sleeping the whole night Ooh, dark well on the bright side it might be daytime again after I'm done mining or, or actually not, because the stone axe is almost running out. Yeah. I have nine granites. Ah, polished granite gonna have a house made of polished stone coarse dirt dirt gravel gravel dirt I wonder what coarse dirt is for uh, I'm gonna look it up on the wiki well later hearing water well water in the game if I ever run into a lava patch I'm definitely gonna use buckets to collect it okay since there was the sound of water that probably means there's a cave nearby well I think I hear lava too ran out. Alright, gonna have to use a stone sword. Fight off enemies for the night. Hopefully I don't run into a skeleton. Oh, I heard a zombie. Anyways, I hope I don't run into a skeleton because I don't have a shield yet. And you practically need a shield to fight against skeletons. <laughs> oh, there's also a creeper. Hit the delay. The delay makes combat a lot harder. Thing. Except the sword. And there's a skeleton. We'll hide from it. Wood planks.
<laughs> now I have a shield. And now I can fight the skeleton. Where'd it go? Well, let's fight the spike. Oh. Shield power. This is why iron is such a great element. store everything First a stone pickaxe and then an iron one. Yay. Alright, so let's put everything away. Hmm. Let's bring the rotten flesh. Milk the cow. Hey, Kaui Waui. Uh, seems like the food poisoning doesn't actually go away. Just because of the food. for the sheep. Wonder if we can shear a chicken. Oh, take the shield off. Oh, we can. Shear another sheep. Right, now we can make the bed. There's going to be a door there. An oak door. 
over. There's three of them. And one here. All right. So next, let's get started on the farm. Uh, we're going to need the seeds, the shovel, and the hoe. Destroying the grass. No <laughs> more seeds. Uh, let's get more water. And now we have an infinite water source. Next, I'm gonna build a fence around the thingy, the fence around the farm. And first, I'm gonna collect a bunch of wood.
twinks and sticks. All right. This will protect the crops from any enemies that try to walk over it. And then there will be a door that leads in and out of the farm. All these seeds.
This will keep the enemies from getting into the house. Seeds. Yeah, as far as I remember, well, the texture of the grown wheat also looks different. Because now they're not signified by black spots anymore. Torches. Well, might as well make some more of them. White dye. Bone meal. heard a zombie. There should be a cave somewhere around here.
Ooh, here's the cave. Wait, let's go back up to get a shield first. Meanwhile, let's also make some of the granite. Well, mine some of it. To make polished granite. <laughs> now it's finally double blocked walls. Yeah. Anyways, uh, I'll be back. Hey, I'm back, and now back to Minecraft. Let's see if there's anything else I need. E. I uh, might as well just put this away <laughs> bring the gravel and some dirt I wonder if the shield can protect from falling damage. Oh, no it can't. Some obsidian. Too bad I don't have any diamond. Oh. Dangerous place to fall under. Let's collect some lava. Ooh, lapis lazuli. Now I can finally dye our sheep uh, that color blue. Whoa, what's in there? that happen huh. enemies from up above
I shouldn't put them too close. Ooh, looks kind of like an erosion thing. <laughs> Iron. Awesome. Ooh, more iron. Hopefully, don't run into any lava down here. You know what really sucks is when you have diamonds and then you fall into lava and then burn to death and then the diamonds all burn. Well, Let's uh, get it back up to the surface. If I can find the way back up. Well, it's definitely not this way. I, I came from that way. there. Ooh, more iron. Huh. These skeletons don't stand a chance. This is every miner's heaven to find a lot of iron. It's almost as good as diamond. Hmm. What was it then? Oh. <laughs> was that a spider? Whoa, that's a long way up. It could easily be monsters up there and there's nothing here uh, nothing of interest up there either so if I can remember I had a gravel staircase Oh, look, there's redstone. <laughs> so many good minerals down here. Ooh, can't go all the way over there. This looks like the place that is closest to the way back up. 
Oh, there it is. The staircase. Well, I have a lot of iron to furnish. This first lava bucket will be used to make... What was it? Oh yeah, for the furnace. I'm gonna furnace all this iron. And I'll make more buckets and try to build a nether portal by dumping lava and water together. Ooh, it's dark. I had to finish the skeleton off. I don't have any more rotten flesh. Oh wait, yeah I do. Redstone, lapis lazuli, dirt, cobblestone. Torch, shovel. Hmm. All right, let's get some dirt. Oh, and rotten flesh, and let's feed the character. First, we'll find a cow. Ooh, a chicken egg. Pop. Okay. <laughs> okay, let's find a place that is kind of low in elevation. Well, no, this isn't good. This is good. One, two, three. Yeah. Alright, he's gonna uh, not run out of any more food points. Ooh, some of the sweet. There's some more wheat over there. Oh, you know, uh, that is it. Blue dye from Lapis Lazuli. And I'll find the tall dirt pillar that's over there. And then 
to build a, another brick pillar right next to it. Should I make five buckets? Well, let's just make three. time we go down there. Yeah, and, and my shield still has a lot of health. even over there. Oh, that doesn't look like it's that far down, which means there's probably still kind of a long way before I reach bedrock. <laughs> so it's gonna take about three trips back and forth to get enough lava to make a portal. Mm. As well, collect some more seeds somehow. Great way to build a portal. That way you don't have to find diamond first before mining obsidian. I don't have any more seeds, so let's just turn all this bone into bone meal. And then do more farming. Let's finish the dirt shelter. Mm. 
Oops. the bone uh -huh. I heard a villager One more trip after this, and I'll be able to make another portal. Well, but first, I'll have to find some more gravel so that I can make flint out of it. Oh, look, there's gravel right here. Oh, yeah, I got the flint. Now to go back up to the surface. Oh, dark again. Yeah. Sleepy Steve. Gunpowder, flint, lava bucket. That's a lot of stone. Now we just need two more up top. So now let's do this. Oh, 
gravel away. Let's make the flint into a flint and steel. And let's uh, do a little more farming. Yeah, that farm is slowly growing. Flint and steel. Torch. Yeah, I'm going to collect. Even though I only really need two left, I'll, I'll just collect four. <laughs> Fire. Ooh. <laughs> and then the fire just disappears while I was looking at it. Oh, at first that thing looked like it was short, and now it suddenly went long. I most likely won't find any diamonds in that cave, because diamonds are really far down. And that cave didn't seem so far down. did it. The rest of this lava, I'll just keep them in storage. I could use them for the furnace. As for this, oh. As for this lapis lazuli, I make it into blue dye, and then turn the sheep blue, and then it'll create more blue sheep when I make them reproduce with wheat. Blue sheep. There's more sheep over there. Yeah, let's turn them all blue too.
<laughs> Maybe also reproduce the cows. sheep around here so they can dye them blue and sheep over there. Let's make a blue sheep farm out of those. Was well, that a villager? Huh. It's a villager. Oh, he takes emeralds. Wait, what is that? Bucket of tropical fish. There's a brown sheep. Yeah, let's dye all of them blue. Closer to the house. Come on, some bees. There's two more over there. Right next to my house. Okay. 
I got another sheep over here. Make me bread. Ah. Three breads. A smithing table. Wonder what a smithing table is. Ah. Okay, first I'm gonna look up coarse dirt on Minecraft Wiki. The sword won't grow grass under any circumstances. Oh, right next, a smithing table. It can be used to craft all the right tools, weapons, and armor. Hmm. So, we used to make things out of netherite. Right back to the game. Let's see how much bread fills you up. About two and a half. Now, let's finally go to the nether. Oh, it actually, I'm gonna have to get some more wood so that I can make more gear. I'm gonna make another stone sword. Right, nether time. Now it'll be easier to defend myself against the ghasts. Oh, there's no safe way down. Right, time to go back to get some wood. Or any black in general. Dirt. 
granite and gravel. Right now, I build this down oh huh, only burn for a little I always I think these gravels are gonna be just like the landmarkings. So it will be easier to remember where to go. Well, oh, hey, zombie pigman. You, you know what I'm about to do? This. Um. <laughs> <laughs> Take that, pigs. <laughs> Landmarkings. I need more of them. Let's say one here. Oh, some nether uh, quartz. Ex extinguishing the flames. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
Sucked. Might as well sleep it off. Let's build another X. Cut up some more trees. Let's make another shield. What was that? Oh, a boat. blocks which means more landmarking mm. oh they're after me Of my landmarkings. Oh, what happens when I go down?
Yeah, not really sure where to go from here. Yeah, making more landmarkings. <laughs> Let's uh, pick a fight with the these zombie pigmen too. Some Minecraft fighter. <laughs> There's no correct way to go. What's up here? Might as well build a landmark in here. as well as we'll start a different type of farm. Another work farm.
fighting in this game becomes much easier once you discover making shields. Well, better hurry back down. Or not. Reading the main temple. Another temple.
see you here. Oh wait. All right. Well, we'll just wrap it up then. Let's. Well, let's go back to the surface. Well, go back to the overall they meant. Yeah, if I can find it. Alright guys, I'm back. Now, uh, to find the overworld. Whoa. Whoa, two diamonds. If only I could have gotten a third. Not too sure what to do with gold except make it into armor. Hey, <laughs> hey, 
Well, before we end, let's do a little more farming. Alright guys, that will be it for this humongous mine vlog. The next time I'll pl I play this game, I'll do the same, record it, upload it as a humongous mine, humongous mine vlog. So this is it for now.